A fire broke out at the in-town suites on West Mercury Boulevard, and right now we know at least two people are hurt. 10 on your side's Rico Bush has been out at the scene all morning. Rico, what have you learned? Well, hey, Katie, right now investigators say that 105 people, at least 105 people, are now out of a place to stay this morning. But we are told that management is relocating these uh, people to some area hotels around the uh, Hampton area. So we want to let you look at what we're looking at here. You can see that some people are still outside. This is after uh, that fire started. It's about four hours after that fire started. We are told we do have video that we want to get right to and show you overnight. Fire investigators say that this uh, fire happened in 221, unit 221 on the second floor of this hotel building. We are told that the fire was contained to that one building. Now, fire investigators say that that sprinkler went off. It caused some water damage as well as some smoke damage to that one apartment unit, but everyone was evacuated due to safety reasons. We are told that that water actually went through the ceiling and into some rooms on the first floor of this hotel building. And that is why people are um, out of a place to stay this morning. We are told that Dominion Power has shut off that power as well as uh, the uh, apartment uh, units will have to be uh, fixed. We are also told that fire investigators moved everyone out because they believe and they fear that that water could get into some wiring as well as electrical uh, boxes. Now, we did talk to one person who lived in this apartment building for quite a few months here. Take a listen to him as he told us about his experience this morning. It's, it's crazy. I mean, we've been out here, you know, like I said, since three something this morning. I had my, my kids with me and everything. And, uh, you know, we've just been trying to stay warm. Now, fire officials have uh, brought trucks here to keep some of those families and children warm this morning. Uh, they are out here trying to uh, keep them warm because, as you can see right now, a lot of people don't have on a lot of clothing. And when you have on very few pieces of clothing, it can get very quite cold uh, during this time of year. Now, we are told that two people uh, did have smoke inhalation, but they were treated on scene and they refused uh, to go to the hospital. We are still trying to work with investigators to see what caused this fire. Of course, we'll stand on top of this story. And once we get those breaking details, we will uh, bring it to you. But for now, that's the latest here in Hampton. I'm Rico Bush. Katie, back to you.